I like real good. I don't that. There's a bunch of things I've never heard of like, at all. I like scary games, uh, and I'm sure you probably do too. No. But it's always bothered I me play that all time, one huh? classic Japanese horror game never came to America. Well, until now, that is. Is this Clock Tower? Oh my god. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> this Clock Tower! Dude, Wayne Forward's bringing Clock Tower? Yo, the original! This is the original, right? Fantastic allows more people to experience something that they may have never Whoa! seen. Whoa! We are definitely looking into more of these. Personally, I want to see more horror games. I'm Mariel Cartwright. I am the creative lead of the Port Plus version of Clock Tower. Nice. Clock I've Tower Plus. I've always been a big horror fan. I love, you know, Resident Evil. Clock Tower is great. It's a very adventure horror series. Horror movies. With horror, but obviously. Clock Tower in particular is a game that I discovered when I was. I watched a uh, Jontron's video on this. I, I watched a bunch of video, people's videos on this. Stop Skeletons for Fighting the video about this years ago. I've ever played as this character Jennifer. I'm trying to get away from the Scissor Man. So cool, the Scissor Man. We have a ton Look of games where you're fighting monsters and sure. you're shooting them with guns. Yeah, don't don't, don't click on the wrong thing or you'll die instantly. But Clock Tower is distinct in that you really don't have any of those tools. Yep. It was one of the first experiences for me. First Outlast style experience. Really was like that in terms of you got no horror. way to defend yourself, and I think that boy. That's you fucked. It is run. true survival horror. Hi, you know, you can only survive, and I think it is a game that has a lot of quieter tension. Yeah. <laughs> Jennifer is such the, an the little animations on the bottom the left are so good. At the start of the game, we don't know a lot about her, and I think the game does such an amazing job of, of Yo, bring Haunted Ground to PS5. Story about I mean, Haunted Ground is just a clock tower game without the clock tower in it. Ending. And I think that's part of what got me so attached. There's kind of like classic the classic reverse classic. engineering aspect of Shantae the game. will show up. Other Dude, Shantae! Back into the game. Usually we always try to have... Will Shantae show up? <laughs> Yo, can we just and play a Shantae in the entire game? That's surprising. Oh, oh! Like River City Zero, we have oh. manga cutscenes. That's a fun little surprise for people. Directing the animated opening is pretty Whoa! Crazy. Animated opening! <laughs> Yo, anime <laughs> clock tower lady! Translations for <laughs> clock tower specifically, there's a lot of like scripting events in there, so there might be a command to say, change the display speed of text. That's kind of been a tricky thing okay. too with localization. It's like, how do I represent that? Make it so that Being you don't have to start everything and fuck it over when he died, that'd be nice. A new vision of this game I would to totally life. play to this. Be a part Full playthrough. Anyway at all is just incredible. Yeah. Dude, this has been really good early next year. Coming to Carbon Engine. PS5, I'm getting on that. 100%. That's sick. That's right. The That's really Super cool. Famicom Classic, Clock Some Tower, good announcements. Being released in English for the first time ever.